The Chemung County Sheriff's Office is sharing a positive development in the recovery of investigator Michael Thetke. After two weeks in the hospital, Thetke will begin the next phase of his care at a rehab center in Rochester. WNY's Alexandra Dern spoke with Sheriff Schramm today and joins us with reaction to that good news. Alexandra. Nick, over the past two weeks, Sheriff Schramm says investigator Thetke went from trauma one ICU to a step down ICU and then eventually to a regular hospital room at Guthrie Robert Packer Hospital. This morning, Thetke left Robert Packer Hospital and a medical transport to Rochester to begin the next phase in his care. Sheriff Schramm says Thetke's loved ones, his medical team, and his brothers and sisters in law enforcement from all around the Twin Tiers are in awe of him as he shows strength and determination after suffering a skull fracture and a brain bleed in the line of duty. The sheriff says Thetke still has a long road of recovery ahead of him, but he continues to improve. I think from our perspective you know today Mike is not the guy that we knew two weeks ago and all any of us hope for is that by the time he finishes his rehab he's the same guy that we knew before and he's back to work soon and um, you know we're going to hold on to that and and uh, trust that that's going to be the ultimate outcome. Sheriff Schramm says investigator Thecky's wife Patrice and his two-year-old and five-year-old sons are pulling for dad. The family is just blown away. They, I don't think there's been a day that's gone by that they have not expressed in some way or another how incredibly um, touched they have been by all the support, not only from his brothers and sisters and the law enforcement family, the attention of the medical professionals toward him, and, and probably even bigger than any of that is the community. Sheriff Schramm continues to thank the Thecky's medical team for the care that he received and the whole community for their ongoing outpouring support. Nick. All right, thank you for that update, Alexandra.